Investigators turned to FDR data to better understand why Fly Dubai Flight 981 performed one successful go-around, but crashed during the second. Investigators analyzed the second attempt at landing, focusing in on the last moments before the crash. Look, there's a leap in airspeed from 153 to 176 in seconds. 10 seconds before the pilots abort, a sudden increase in the plane's airspeed was recorded. Investigators determined that a strong gust of wind struck the plane. How did the pilots respond this time? Let me see. Well, they added max power. And what about the flaps and landing gear? Mm, flaps are retracted. Gear retracted. The data reveals that on the second go-around, the pilots performed a different procedure. On a standard go-around, the flaps and landing gear are retracted. Investigators conclude that on the second attempt, the crew flew a hybrid of two procedures. They used the power of a wind shear escape maneuver with the gear and flap settings of a traditional go-around. So what would that do to the plane? You need to take a look at all the factors at play. They were holding on for nearly two hours. That's four tons of fuel they burned. The weight of the Boeing 737 is a critical factor in the plane's performance. Adding the weight of the plane, Total weight, that's 54 tons. Investigators turned to computer modeling to answer a crucial question. Here's all the data for the first and second go around. Yeah. How did the rate of acceleration differ at the start of the two attempts? First go around, speed increased by 17 knots. And the second? Second go around. 25 knot increase. Well, it's a difference of eight knots between the two go arounds. Mm, yeah. Could the increase in acceleration have affected the pilots themselves? They calculate the impact of the second go around. Wow, look at the backward force experienced by the pilot. The team also examines the impact of vertical acceleration. G-force would have lifted the pilots upwards. So sudden acceleration like this, hmm. both horizontal and vertical, I'll play tricks on your mind. Were Captain Socrates' senses his worst enemy? <laughs> 